Hi, Yujesh here from GTC 2012. It's been a fantastic show. This is the third and final day of the show. Let me just give you a breakdown of some of the things that happened. There were 2,700 attendees at the show this year from 54 different countries. We had over 340 speaking sessions covering 34 different disciplines, things like computer vision, life sciences, oil and gas, but it was amazing in terms of the things that they're doing with GPUs. We had three keynotes, obviously Jensen kicked off the first keynote, where we talked about the compute side of Kepler and all the things we're doing there for the HPC market. Uh, we then talked a bit about graphics, gave a recap of our GTX 690 and showed off some really cool graphics demos that we were working on where we combined not only physics and simulation, but also real-time ray tracing. So that was very cool. And then finally, we surprised everyone with it, an announcement that we made about how we were taking the GPU into the cloud, uh, not only for enterprise by supporting things like virtual desktops or actually remoting, say, uh, a Maya or a Nuke session from a server farm over to your desktop, but even on the gaming side, we showed a simple green Ethernet cable plugged into a LG smart TV, and that turns into the game console. So we had a GeForce sitting in the cloud running on Gaikai's uh, server farm, and we call that GeForce Grid. So all of that was covered here. Uh, the second two days, we had a keynote on flock behavior and behavior simulation and how that research using GPUs is going to hopefully one day stop some of the locust plagues that are attacking some of the regions in Africa. And then today we had the part-time scientists talking about rover vehicle that they're going to send up to the moon and that's going to be using GPUs to power all that. So incredible three days worth of science, research, and cool innovative ways of using GPUs. If you weren't able to make it this year, come next year. We're going to be having it next March, so hopefully we'll see you all here next year.